heads in the clouds and what a feat for. Been stuck on the ground and I'm getting more than the turn of the sound that's been messing around and it's not that you Pay to play? For real, so what you want to do? Play to earn. And I can't sit still And I'm showing I'll be pissed Cause I got no chill Pushing everybody's limits And they're like, for oh, real? They know I'm gonna bring it But it's no big deal Cause I'm on the... So, I think we're ready to get the first match on the way. We sure are. All right. Becky Let's is do it, in. my Let's dude. Let's go. Three, two, one. Let's go. It's game time, baby. <laughs> game time. <laughs> All and right. We're already, All seeing, right. we're already seeing a random, just different kind of reptile from Zeki. That's Spiky Wing. Spiky Wing has been amazing. Yeah, um, just really liking Spiky lately, Wing. it's been so strong because these people putting them the, those brick walls, uh-uh, not having it. This backline and is, yeah, this backline is really nice. And speed only 42 as well, I like it. And bro, it's plant, plant, reptile versus aqua, aqua, bird. Yeah. With Yikes. double watering can. Yikes. Double cactus and Yikes. double hot putt. Yikes. I. Yikes. I, I mean, that is yeah. painful. Double anemone, not gonna save you right now. This, uh, I mean, risky fish, not bad. Risky fish sandal combo, not bad. Um, yeah, it'll do some damage. It'll do some but damage, not yeah. enough. Uh, right? Risky fish bug splat. Yeah, it's not enough. It's not gonna be enough. No way. No, this is wow. a tough, tough matchup for uh, Jotki from Metana. Very, very tough matchup. Um, if Jotki's gonna have to. Try to, it's gonna be like one of those fights. He's gonna have to be like Floyd Mayweather, you know? He's gonna have to dance and he's gonna have to catch him with some clean, clean jabs. Clean, clean, he's gonna and have to the critical dodge. gods must be smiling as well. <laughs> yeah, they have to smile. dodge the watering can, dodge the watering can, drop the critical, take out the plant with the quickness, and then, you know, take it from there. For sure. This aqua stock, aka watering can, is going to be a really big key in this game right but a simple fact i mean two plants with uh aqua stock versus two aquas i mean that's this energy galore then if it does come down to the 1v1 right i mean zeki's reptile is just gonna be too much for this uh bird in the back here even the 1v2 <laughs> i'm not feeling so confident you yeah, know what i'm saying yeah, like sure. that rep honestly the 1v3 wouldn't even surprise <laughs> me that much because that's just three turns right yeah three turns with all cards high shield uh four cards a turn but the spiky wing wouldn't be optimal for a 1v3 that's for sure yo x912 yeah baby we live baby <laughs> what's up man How we you live doing? baby <laughs> welcome 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 <laughs> oh shit he's live let go <laughs> Yeah, we are waiting. This is the first game of the of the weekend. Let's friggin' go. I mean, perfect, perfect team uh, selection from Zaki here, man. Oh, Zaki. You definitely, yeah, you can't complain about that one. Yeah. <laughs> perfect. You want to be in this. We are just waiting for the game to get underway. We're going to have yeah, some... So remember, everyone, they... They have built in a uh, decently long delay. That way, the stream does not really need to be delayed. Double serious round fantastic. one. <laughs> Ooh, that's brutal. <laughs> that's just sad, Panda. Yikes. That the. So, okay, so double serious. Many top pros would tell you that is not the play for the simple reason of you play double serious right off the bat. Um,. They don't have to worry about it anymore for the rest of the game, right? True. The other side of it is it's a pretty big momentum swing. Indeed. With, yeah, it kind of depends on the round two. Let's just say you get double serious round one and, you know, the opponent doesn't move and Oof. you get both of the steals. 
Oh, he didn't get the kill. He didn't get the kill, Full yeah. And, HP. and that's uh, to do with the balance changes. And look at that. Now Cactus Dumb's 179 damage. Okay, so A, that, and B. I want everyone to realize, like, 12 HP, that is the difference of having one more beast move right there. Yep, yep, If you have yep. one more beast move, you're good. You're, wow. you're chilling. You, you get that kill. Um, and because of that, now it's just... It's a 2v1 the other way. Yeah, yeah. This is the quickest game ever. <laughs> but you know ever. what? Okay, Chief, was you surprised with the Cactus buff? Well... This is the thing about cactus, right? GG's plants are in the slow. chat. Mm -hmm. GG's in the chat. Ca uh, plants are slow, and cactus is really weak, like defensively. Defensive wise, yes. So you you die a lot before you get to use your cactus, and if you're low on life, it becomes a pretty dead card. Like if you're at yeah, like half HP, no shield. And they, yep. yeah, you're, it just becomes kind of a dead card really quickly. Um, I think it's okay. It was a minor buff, right? Yeah, so it, it, was, yeah, it, it wasn't was, crazy, but yeah. All right, they're in for round two. Let's freaking go. All right, three, two, one. Hey, go. Let's see if it's going to be the same teams or there's going to be a change. Oh, a little change. Switched out to a plant midliner here. Not a decent, not a bad, not a bad uh, plant as well. Got the cactus, as we were just talking about, the prickly trap drained by it. The, the Bidens with the cleanse scent, right? And the spicy surprise hot butt. And this bird does have the double talk, even though oh, it was also the nerfed. Bird. Yep, 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 yep. Um, but what in the what? What in the what? But I mean, Why? it Why? still ignores the shield though, bro. <laughs> like, ignore True, <laughs> true, but still it doesn't kill anymore, right? That's what mm. they change. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the not double talk kill itself a... doesn't kill right it's it's not gonna get the 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 kill on the reptile um i don't think in the one turn you need the one bla one turn blast it right um and if you don't kill that reptile in one turn you're dead you're just dead like you're dead it doesn't matter which cards the reptile played you're dead <laughs> all right so same teams from zeki here uh jolt key you know, does goes with the midline and backline change, but I mean, the reptile still has the advantage, I guess. But let's just see how double talk. To be honest, I haven't actually seen the like a one v one with uh, double talk just yet, right? So, actually, I'm curious to see how it's gonna play out. Shall see. Okay, so um, I I'm just gonna point this out so everyone else that's watching understands this rule. It has been mentioned many many times. The tournament has started. You may no longer send axes to each other, to your teammates, to your friends, to anybody in the tournament. If you do and they use that axe, that is an instant disqualification. I'm bringing this up because Zeki said this guy just got new axes. We're not gonna. Just, they're just gonna play this because it's a terrible matchup anyway. <laughs> yeah. So they didn't even. They didn't even send the right axes. Wait. So this guy literally just got sent axes just now. That's what it sounds like, because I know he's scouted. You're just going to have to check scouted. the Ronin. Check the Ronin. Yeah, we, we, I'm pretty sure this matchup is so one-sided, it's not going to matter. I mean, yeah, but, Zeki still looks like the advantage anyway. Yeah, we're just going to use this as an example for everyone. Do not send axes, because smart players are scouting you. So they see if you have three axes or five axes, and if all of a sudden some axe pops onto the field that they've never seen they're like uh yeah about that you just <laughs> you just countered me and wasted all my scouting time by doing that basically that's why we don't allow it because players if we, if we want this to be an esports which it is but if we want it to be like high high level you have to go in scout your opponent and be prepared for whatever they can bring. And you can't do that if they're getting airdropped axes left and right, you know, in between <laughs> games. Yeah, that's not fair, man. That's just not fair. So, and you know, this is blockchain, right? So you can't hide, <laughs> right? Yeah, uh, I mean, we can check it all. I just, I really don't everything. want to. So yeah, just don't do it. But maybe that needs to be like, you know, I'm sure it's already, that's already in the rules, right, Chief? Yeah. So yeah, if it's already in the rules, then, you know, you're breaking them. <laughs> you, you deserve the disqualification, right? But, it, you know, so... We're gonna let it roll. We're gonna let it roll. We're not gonna start it off with a 
with a drama. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's gonna be okay. Okay. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, Do it. If we can, if we can just have the series end naturally and everyone learns their lesson, hey, that's that's two flies, one swatter thing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> two yeah. birds, one stone. That was wrong. <laughs> yeah, two flies, one swatter. But to be that's fair, that the still, it still works, though. That still works. You can still do yeah, it, the right? funny thing is, in German, <laughs> that's how you say it. That's like the German version, but in English. Oh, my brain right, got, right, my brain right, got... <laughs> right. <laughs> that's cool, man. That's, That's cool. funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to Germany in a month or in like three weeks. So oh, my nice. brain's, I'm already kind of thinking about it. I'm already yeah. starting to think about it again. Yeah, Hasheki, Hasheki, Hasheki's in, right? You remember you can yeah, check. Yeah, Hasheki's in. Yeah, you can check, guys. If you want to check who's in the tournament, it, easy. Exclamation mark bracket. Exclamation, oops. If I, if I can spell, if I can spell though. Right. Bracker. <laughs> Hit him with I the bracket. <laughs> I have to be able to, you have to be able to spell bracket right in order for the command to work, yeah? FYI. <laughs> but yeah, check check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Let's freaking okay, go. Oh my goodness. They are unloading. Yep. They are Round absolutely two. unloading here. Holy crap. Both trainers going in. Oh, and he gets the crit on the Nemo. Isn't that just a sad story? <laughs> Isn't that just a sad story? Oh, the big damage. This aqua is going damage. down. Oh, and this is going to be the just plants. short again. Just plant, short yep. again. There's just not enough this damage on out this here. team. Yep. One Check the ladder. Later. Double cap. And the, the energy. And the energy was stolen. Yep, yep, yep. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And uh, Zeki has the double hurt. Oh, but the, oh yeah, the herbivore was stopped. By the hot butt. 56 damage with the double talk to finish off the plant. Going into round five. Okay, so two axes each. So this isn't over for um Jotki, and I say that because he still has this plant, which and it's is got beefy. zigzag, yeah. Exactly. It's got the heel. It's got the Bidens. It, it, it can do some tingies. Yeah. Um, the watering can's not huge here, and he could try to like survive and cycle bird damage. There's yeah. no heels on this on this team from Zeki. That's true. And look, as as but, you can see now, Jokey's going in with a four card bird combo. I think Jokey went a little bit too hard with the defensive cards on his tank. Um, he should have just used like hot butt cactus. Hot butt. Yeah. And save the rest because um, he needs those cards to stay alive. Yeah. But okay, he's in a good spot here. That in a tiny spot. dino. Then the Sarastus. Some <laughs> decent damage. But look at that Biden's. Then he's gonna heal up again. This is this is imagine good stall, if he had some more, play. Imagine if he had some more cards, right? He could have played this even better. Yeah. So real. he's in a decent spot. Jot here, they are in a decent spot, but. Could have been even cleaner. So yeah. let's see what happens. Just so everyone knows out there, this game comes down to like minimal, minimal things. It's tiny. He is stalling though. Yeah, he he's is stalling. stalling great. Like right now, Jokey is doing a bunch with this tank, this midliner. Cause Zeki's not able to kill this round. Look at that. And that hot butt is coming yep. through clutch over oh, and over wow. earlier. And... Wow, okay. He's got one of the double talks. He needs one more. Hmm. And look at that. And he needs the, the, the sable. Okay, well, hold on. This is going to be close. He's going to have the energy. He's got the double talks. Oh. I think it's enough. Oh. Let's see. This Let's is see. brutal. Oh, no. Oh, this is going to a game free, Chief. This is going to a game free. Well, I'm going to say Jotki better use G the axes that were on his account chat. before it started. G Jeez. Oh, sorry. It makes oh. it <laughs> That makes that awkward. So <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. I'll, I'll remove the cursor next game. So sorry. So sorry. <laughs> GG's in the chat, though. We're going to a game free. That midliner was the difference. That midliner was able to stall with the zigzag and the bidens, able to, you know, uh, destruct Zeki's reptile with the hot butt, right? Because remember, he was basically 
cycling between the hot butt plus the kestrel the kestrel disables the horn move as well right so that kind of put zeki in, in a bit of a prop in a bit of some issues right so uh that was interesting let's see what's gonna happen in game three who have you guys got i mean the predictions was like a landslide right but let's see now yeah because this is game three and they're in they're in all right let's go let's get back in the action three two oh boy one there go you said oh boy chief what does that mean well because <laughs> i told zeki to keep playing and just win and now he lost oh wow he just hard countered him so bad though wow <laughs> that, oh god wow never mind okay zeki is taking this like a champ he reported <laughs> it but he's just playing on he's just like whatever wow. dude i'm just gonna i'm just gonna counter this team and beat him whatever <laughs> this uh I this midliner that. is pretty nice look at this the zigzag the branch charge the bidens and the numbing lecration aka the gravel ant i mean obviously it's not gonna do too much to the bird but that midline is done that's a complete shutdown then zeki has oh wow i mean look at this right so it's gonna be how quickly can uh zeki draw the little owl aka dark sweep combo right so what he'll probably do is you know dark sweep targets the fastest enemy which is the bird Correct. then you know <clears throat> lay the lay the smack of down on that bird yeah, then the yeah smacketh. <laughs> the smacketh. so there's like two ways zeki wins this game fairly quickly if he pulls like double cactus or cactus hot butt he's, he if he can kill the aqua quickly yeah and then he just needs the double swoop right yeah yep yep the midliner is going to absolutely annihilate the midliner from jot key with the gravel land for in sure one v one because this is a bird bait team from zeki so what he does what you do is once your tank is down you use the eggshells to keep your plant your midliner alive as long or as as long as you want to um sometimes you don't want to so you just use you know the pigeon post to give the aroma to the other team yeah oh all right i mean let's see how this match is gonna work out i think yeah zeki has the advantage definitely with the gravel and plus the uh dark swoop as well that dark swoop is <laughs> That's re that's gonna be really big in this game. Oh, cursor, cursor. <laughs> well, Indez play. Indez is not in this tournament. He is sick, uh, so he's not in this tournament this weekend. But you know, I'm sure we definitely haven't seen the last of Indez. So you know. Oh no, definitely yeah. not. Indez yeah. is around. <clears throat> Indez is with the boys. They're getting in some practice. He's he's not gone. He's just been sick, you know, and he's been busy and sick. So. He'll be back. Don't even trip. He's still out there doing his thing. He's still ranked like he was like top 30 yesterday. So he's still playing. Yeah. Nice. And cool, getting man. top 30 nowadays means you played a lot of games. Yes, indeed. Indeed. Really, um, really quickly. <laughs> no, X, he's he's unwell right now. I don't know exactly what's wrong with him, but he's not like 100% right now. But of course, Indes is a sick player as well. <laughs> you know that. <laughs> he's sick and he's sick. Yes and he, just yes. This yes. yes and yes. <laughs> yes. X912, yes. I appreciate all you guys hanging out, man. I hope you guys are enjoying this. This is this round one, you know, round one of the whole tournament. So this tournament this weekend is going to be insane. Indes is always sick when he has to go to school. Hope his teachers aren't watching. <laughs> Just saying. Sequinox TV, what is good? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, I see what that is. That's really cool. Udista, also welcome. First time chat from viewer. Mad Burn. That's great. Yeah, we that got is some a new, great... We got some new viewers in here, man. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Elijah on top now. Is, yeah, is he number one in arena right now? He was grinding. I saw him top 10 earlier. Oh, Elijah's, Mo, the background Elijah's music and turn arena. up the game sound. No, game sound? You crazy. But welcome. <laughs> game sound but welcome. No, game sound is not... Oh. <laughs> that's, that's funny. That's a first. 
Rain is participating. What is good, Stressor? Welcome, welcome. Greetings from the Philippines. Goods, not goods. Let's go, baby. Monkey. Game sound. That's funny. I like that, though. I mean, I'll do that. I can do that thing, but game sound isn't really, you know. Okay, nice from Zeki putting up the shield. What up, Sphinx? How's it going? Is this Sphinx that's playing on stream next? Oh, and the energy for Zeki. Wow, look nom, at that. Nom, 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 That oh, aqua that stock. Was brutal. That aqua stock, man. Doing, doing work right there. What a turn. What a turn for Zeki. Ouch. Ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. Ruthless Reg is not participating. He is on an airplane back to the Philippines. Zeki taking out. Oh my goodness. The math from Zeki. The math was perfect. <laughs> wow. He takes out the front axie. Wow. He gravel ants the midliner. Wow. And he has the energy to attack. Not really the damage, but he not does the have damage, the energy. Yeah. But branch charge. Branch charge is he, there as well. Branch charge, that'll do some damage. Wow, but that was perfect. That what a midliner. Turn. Now is literally it's not doing anything next turn. Wow, that was beautiful. It's one one, Ken. One one. All right, sorry. Let me put the. I, I removed the scoreboard. I'll put it back because it was blocking. All right, scoreboard is back up. Whoop, so, whoop, whoop. Good's not good. Not good. All right, let's uh -huh. get the scoreboard updated. Uh -huh. Mods, if we can get the scoreboard updated, that'll be great. It's one to one. Zeki was a fine lad and played, even though there was a uh, little bit of a rule break. Oh, he does have to use that last card and lose life on his bird. And is there going to be a crit here? This is the question. Let's see. Ooh, no, no there is no crit. Survives with 89 HP. Not sure what the okay. single, single all out shot was. Let's see? That was interesting. That was kind of just like, hey, hurt yeah. me more. <laughs> oh, hurt may me maybe more. to go faster. Maybe to go faster next uh, round, maybe. He's already uh, faster, though. Oh, um, I don't know what right? that was for then. <laughs> oh, wait, let's check. Let's check. Hold on. Uh, this is maybe he just assumes he's going to die. Yeah, yeah. The bird. Yeah, the what? Yeah, that was already. Fun. He probably just assumes he's going to die. Oh, yep. Well, now, oh. now he's dead. <laughs> now he's about to die. Later. Okay, he didn't even have to use the last card. Is this enough? Hmm. Oh, Zeki, Zeki, this is that. Was... This is a. This is getting kind of close. Yep, yep, yep. But hold on. But now, okay. So the bird is gone. So he sacrifices the bird, right? But Zeki's got the energy advantage. He's got a lot of energy. Yeah, this a lot is of true. energy. So, look at that. All right. And Zeki's just gonna go in. Oh, this should be enough. It's not like, gonna be enough maybe to not to oh, kill. The critical. Oh, well, now it is. Yeah, yeah. GG. Zeki taking it. G friggin' G. Well, he deserves it. He he gave him the he gave G. him the series. He gave him a chance, even though. Well yeah. done, Zeki. Well done. Good games. Well done. Good G -G. games. Good's not good. Alright. Chief seems like they looks like they're in now. Finally. Are you ready, my yes, dude? Alright. They fixed it. We are back. We are back. Alright. Three. Let's do it. Two. One Lego. Oh baby. It's thank you guys for your patience. Some some small technical difficulties, but it's all good, baby. We out here. Ooh, double anemone, double anemone with a backdoor bird against plant plant with a non-backdoor bird. This is interesting. So what I see here is the backdoor bird. If he can if Sphinx can kill Henlo's bird early, even though these two plants seem like they should dominate. With all the Anemone action, there is a chance that Sphinx could just out heal True. and sacrifice his bird. And just, he just needs to kill the bird and sacrifice his bird and then go into like the heal game. Cause there's no watering cans. There's no serious. So mm. he could overpower with heal and, you know, damage, but he may run out of cards. True. And the, the gravel ant only shuts down the the horn anemone and the mouth and tail move but the back anemone is still going to be active correct hmm. and there's yeah. no, only so many gravel ants right yes correct <clears throat> wow yeah so think yes yeah, Sphinx is obviously going to use the dark swoop right. anemona anemona anemone anemone <laughs> anemone 
A bird with a balloon, a cutie though. It's yeah, a cutie, I, 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 though. I, like this, I like this combo for sure. It's a nice bird. I mean, that thing has massive damage. And if Sphinx doesn't pull the backdoor cards quickly, that bird will erase everything. Uh, yeah, yes, indeed. Yeah, Sphinx, yeah, Sphinx key to victory is definitely eliminating that bird. That is top priority. With quickness, sir. Mm -hmm. With quickness. <laughs> With haste, sir. Yeah. With haste. <laughs> and Henlo also playing this bird bait style team. Two plants with the bird with the eggshell. He's doing the balloon style instead of the um, pigeon post style. So if he plays eggshell, he fully commits. Anytime. Since there's no serious, Sphinx can spam all his Nemos. Yep. I think that's kind of a really big advantage for Sphinx as well. Not uh, Henlo, Henlo not having at least one tank with, uh, you know, serious AKA vegetable, but that's, uh, you know. In this situation though, it doesn't matter because Sphinx is not gonna have enough cards to play. That's the thing. You kind of play double Nemo thinking you're gonna lose some energy, right? And now he like, as of now, Sphinx probably shouldn't play any more Nemos because yeah. he doesn't want to draw them. He wants to draw everything else but Nemo. Mm -hmm. And he could, as I mean, you know, able to build up that energy can definitely save up for like a big rush and yes, maybe eliminate sure. one of the plants. He's going to have to go kind of ticky tacky though, right? Because he has to heal already. Yeah. And this is going to do no damage, which is the worst part about it. Interesting formation for the Sphinx, to be honest. Got this uh, split mid uh, front line, right? And it's it, it's decent in this matchup. It's not bad at yeah. all. Yeah, <clears throat> but it's just not knowing who to defend sometimes could be tricky about having a split front line. Same with the attack for the tank, though, right? So yeah, but yes, yeah, it makes the whole game a bit more random. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Mm, okay. Gravelan is a real winning condition card. Yeah, no, Gravelan uh, in many games is the win condition. That's why you put the eggshell behind it. So that in the late game, if you're in that position where you want your Gravelant to shut them down, you just sacrifice the bird and leave your plant in the middle alive. Mm -hmm. mm. So Eggshell is the most important card on Henlo's team generally. In this matchup, not really because of the back door from Sphinx. Yeah, that back door is gonna, <laughs> gonna hit hard <laughs> once, he, once uh, Sphinx gets the cards. Okay, no, no dark suit just yet. But look at this, Enlo still not able to grab, get the kill. I think Sphinx is. Look at the energy advantage, man. Eight energy on coming from Sphinx there. Yeah, and so the <clears throat> now I'm interested to see if Sphinx plays those Nemos. He shouldn't, he no, definitely shouldn't. I, yeah, oh, I no think. backdoor, no backdoor. Yeah, still no backdoor, yeah, yeah. Oh, that is brutal. That is absolutely brutal for Sphinx. That happens sometimes, man. Sometimes you just need that one card and you just don't get it. And you're like, oh my word, if I had, oh, there we go, there we go. Sphinx has got it, bye bye birdie. Bye bye birdie, and there's three cards on that bird. So Bye. now Henlo's got no cards. Wow. That was everything. That was always going to be a risky play, to be honest. That's why Henlo needs should have, you know, got the early value from the bird, right? Because you already know. Yes, correct. That bird is going to be correct, gone. Correct. Yeah. When you are playing against a back door that is going to target a certain Axie, and you know this, you must use their cards ASAP, yep. like as soon as possible. Because now's when that energy comes into play and he can just unload. Yep. Wow. Okay, look at this. Sphinx is going to go into the 2v1. Okay. Let's see how this plays out. Ooh, and Henlo's not going to get the kill here. So that means Sphinx is going to sacrifice his bird as soon as he gets that eggshell. That's not going to be enough to kill. Oh, wow. This is still a close game, yep, but yep. Henlo is in a decent gonna, spot. Yeah, he's going to sacrifice the Here's bird, the sacrifice. then heal up, heal up with the anemone next round. Still got a bunch of energy as well. This is going to be Henlo's an interesting one. using all his cards, yep, right? He yep. put up 
all the cards right there. Oh, look at this. And there's Soon all the anemone. Gonna up. Yep. Gonna heal up to full health. 400 it's so annoying heal, when, they, wow. when they heal. It's so, it's so annoying. It is rage inducing almost. It's, it I is know. rage inducing. It no. is rage inducing. <laughs> oh my goodness. And oh my goodness. Look at the Gravelant though. The, it, it sh he terrible draw. A fair draw because Gravelant shuts him down. But uh, yeah, Penlo is going to bring it home. GG. He is going to bring it home. GG. That well was a played. tough one, well but played. Penlo got it done. G freaking G's in the chat. I Let's felt go. like it shouldn't have been that hard. There was some mistakes were made, but well done. <laughs> well done. Crazy match. Yeah, Crazy match. Good one. Good one. Good one. I mean, the cactus buff, I mean, you know, nightmare for Aquas. So, uh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Cancer versus cancer. That was a nice game. Yeah, that was a nice game. That was well played. Both players were battling. So what do you think? You think they're gonna switch it up, or you think they're gonna bring the same teams? I think Sphinx needs to switch it up. I hope yeah. he's got another team in mind. I think Henlo's Henlo's looks like a scholar, so I'm not how i'm not uh sure how deep the axie pool is so maybe could come with a slight change but that was a i mean it's a good team right i would say maybe have a serious in there but uh you know see a serious Sphinx, would have been nice yeah a serious would have been nice in that game because that would have stopped the the energy the massive energy put up i don't think he would have stopped because you know he had double anemone with nemo right so but it would have made him think just a little mm. bit more yeah, well, it changes. It kind of changes the flow of it, right? Yeah, indeed. Indeed. We gonna see a beast, yo. I, I mean, this is round one, right? So we're definitely gonna see beasts in this tournament. But yeah, let's see if we see one next game. All right, they're back in. Do it. Three, two, one. Lego. Lego. All right, um, take over for one sec. Let me figure right. something out for the um, oh, next round. Oh, of... look at that. Who said that? It, a beast came as you requested. Look at that. Sphinx with the change. Goes with the plant and scarab tank. Going for that straight counter for the anemone. But actually, I, hold on, I just realized, hold on, Sphinx played an enemy last game. Actually, no. So it was not a counter, but it but will be countering the drain bite right here, right? So not bad with the scarab, scarab, snake jar, beach, and the serious. But look at this beast. Scarab, look at this double nutcracker, right? With the dual blade and the scarab curse. Nice beast here. This beast... And the 59 morale as well. This beast is going to tear these plants apart. Right? But the key is... Oh, wow. So I'm, I'm looking at this here. This Gravelant can still shut down the beast's uh, majority of the beast moves. Actually, the, the mouth and the horn. But Scarab and the Tail Nutcracker are both ranged attacks. So that's not going to completely shut down this beast. Wow, Sphinx is... Uh, Sphinx has got the little wild uh, dark swoop as well. Hmm. This is going to be a really good match. I like it. That was yeah. a great call on the beast. Yep. Um, plus the bird. The bird will do what it... If the bird does any better than it did last game. I mean... Chilling. Yeah. And that's Scarab. Like you said, Scarab is so good now. Yep. Scarab just says, nope, sorry, Zigzag, nope. never again. No heels for you, buddy. Look at that, got the scarab on the front and the mid, right? So, and look at that, counters both of the um, Henlo's uh, zigzags. Drain, aka what drain up, bites. Up. Welcome, welcome, Lloyd VY uh, Levens, Denzel Custodio. <clears throat> Sphinx will win this, no cap. Yeah. No cap, leg out. I'm, I'm, yeah, Sphinx is in a really good position. Really good. Well, just, you know, just looking at the teams. You would give the advantage, right? But we we shall oh, see. Absolutely. We shall see how it plays out. You never know. But yeah. We could be going to a I'm game three already. It, yeah, I'm liking That'd it. That'd be as well. nice. That'd be nice. We would love a, a nice little rubber match right off yeah, the bat. Yeah. 
<laughs> Rip heel. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Rip heel. Yeah. Check you later, heel. Yeah, the, the 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 votes are piling in on Sphinx right now. I'd really like to see um the scarab in action. I yeah. haven't actually seen it in action. Yeah, since the since the buff, yeah, or since the balance change. Oh, critical right off the bat. Ooh. Not bad. Damn. Sphinx definitely wasn't expecting that, right? And that changes everything, right? <clears throat> yeah, that... Oh, he didn't use the... He didn't use the... um. Wait, what? Oh, that's why. That's why he used the eggshell. He used the eggshell mm -hmm. to protect what? the plant. He used the eggshell to protect the plant. <clears throat> He's going to heal with his plant. Or no, not no, no, heal. No, no, yeah, you can't heal with that kill. plant. He's yeah, just yeah, going to kill. kill. Yeah. He's going to kill. But now he plays the... See, because now he's not going to die yeah, he's not again. Gonna die this again. isn't going to yeah. kill. Wow. Well done. Well played by and then, Sphinx. Then, Sphinx is playing this really well. Really well, because he... So Sphinx already has the Dark Soup combo, right? Lacking the energy. I say and that, don't but forget, no. don't forget, Sphinx oh. had the bad matchup last game and played it really well. Yep, yep, yep. This oh, is gonna balloon. Kill. This is balloon. Gonna, Even this if is it didn't kill, kill yeah. balloon. I know. Wow. Wow, Sphinx is now Sphinx just needs to relax. Actually, but there's no you, there's no beast cards. There's no beast cards. You will get cards. the kill here with this, but yeah. it will be a last stand. Oh no, last stand. Lucky Henlo because he just played uh, that last, and he should have played it first. And if there was a last stand, he would have gotten rid of it with the Biden. So very lucky play right there. And look at this. Now he disables some cards. Mm -hmm. And Henlo might still win this. Is yeah, brutal as that see. sounds. But with this, oh, the scarab again. No Wait, heal, no heal. Oh, and Sphinx is gonna, Beast is gonna survive as well. Oh, he's sacrificing the bird. No heal as well, wow. Scarab coming through clutch right now and look at that free energy let's friggin go man so boom holy for the first time, yo gee, we see gee, scarab we, gee, someone clip that someone gee. clip that someone clip, clip that. that scarab in action scarab, scarab in action baby gee, oh my gee. goodness that was beautiful we said it at the start of the game we want to see scarab in action and there it was winning it yes wow uh-huh that was beautiful beautiful Countering Countering basically the Kairu plant. I love the it. Scarab. Love wow. it. Wow. Absolutely. Sphinx, easy peasy. Well played. La let's go, baby. Love let's freaking go. Absolutely. That love was that. sick. That, was, that was sick. Right on cue. Thank yep. you, Sphinx. Yep. Right yep. on yep. cue. And now Henlo from CTG back against the wall. Back against the wall. Hello, Sphinx could it be a reverse out. sweep? Could it be a reverse sweep incoming? Goods not goods. Chill not chill. We are in round one. Axie Elite Open number five. Lego. Uh, 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 it's go, baby. <laughs> Son of Geos. <laughs> you know, you know that's what that's what happens when you get crits. You're, you're called the Son of Geos now. Something like that. <laughs> hey, what do you I mean. That was all about the scarab, right? Yeah, yeah. That, <laughs> that was, was that was all scarab about play. The scarab. That was beautiful scarab play for sure. I hope someone clipped that. I hope someone clipped that. If not, where are we at? It was like at one hour. Yeah, that was one hour. Uh, yeah, one hour in. Like one hour in. So a giveaways and time. What stamps. time will rain the battle? Uh, not one sure. hour scarab action. If you want to be in this tournament, right, this is what you need to do. You need to make sure you follow us on Twitter. And as soon as uh, the signups are open, they will be tweeted out. You need to sign up immediately. Right? Immediately. Yeah, it goes fast. Hmm. So you want to make sure you sign up immediately. Right? <clears throat> And this time, you know, the, the link got out a bit early, so it went extra fast. Wow. Ugh.
the keep so you know close, a close lid on that chief sure that doesn't go well leaked. it was more of a it was more of a miscommunication than a than a malicious leak. <laughs> omj oh my g hose <laughs> Is that the new one, yeah? The new, the That's new one. The new new one. That's OMG. the new one. That's the new one. OMJ. It's no, it's no, no more OMG anymore. OMJ, yeah. OMJ. OMJ. I like it. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I got my money on Sphinx. I got my money on Sphinx. The Sphinx the predictions cool. are up in chat. Hop on in there. We probably only need to do. Only need prediction for each. You want in, yeah? Just make sure you follow us on Twitter. Um, the next, are you releasing the date for the next tournament? Yeah, or? Uh, no, because there yeah. isn't one yet. We have uh, to make it. Uh, this was the last one on the official schedule. So now we got to see when I go to Germany and we're going to plan it around that. All right. It'll probably be sometime right the week before Christmas, I'm assuming. Oh, week before. All right, anyway, we'll talk about it. But... Let's see. We'll yeah, talk yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Just, I don't know, just follow we'll us on see. Twitter. Just follow on and Twitter. And we might take you know, one month out. off. Forgive P us. We might take yeah. one month off for Christmas December's and family. Always, always December's a always kind yeah. of tricky, yeah. Tricky. So we'll probably take December mm. off and then come back hard in January. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm be talking about, babe. All right, so game three coming up. What's going on? I'm seeing both of these guys. I don't know what's going on. They're taking time. This is round one, guys. Not they're thinking, <laughs> they're thinking. So, hey, <clears throat> there was, the clip was made. So let's get this out on social media. You know what I'm saying? Let's get this tournament trending on social media. Everyone, push it. Let's get, yeah, let's we get need, it. We need the social media tweet. support, let's guys. Let's give them a tweet. We got to keep that social media tweet, going, tweet, going tweet, ham. Tweet, tweet, going tweet, ham. Tweet, tweet, tweet. <laughs> All right, they, they are in, Chief. Game free. Let's go. All right. Hashtag Axie open. Hashtag Axie open. That's it. Get it out there. Get right. it out there. Game three Ready? coming right up. Let's freaking go. Let's do it. All right, we're going in. Three, two, one. Lego. Pick up. All right, so a complete change from uh, Hello. No, no. That's uh, what I like to see. No, uh, still no um, Dark Swoop, though. So interesting. Change the birds. But uh, no dark swoop, so okay. Then um, this uh, this dusk. Uh, what was it like? Mod Terminator, something like that. Interesting. Um, isn't that the Elijahnator or whatever? Elijahnator, I don't know. The CGT. I mean, C uh, anyway, moving on. Habla babla boo. <laughs> Habla babla boo. Anyways, what I don't on. understand is putting that bird in doesn't really change the exactly. Matchup. Yeah, that was my I don't point. Get it. That I was gonna get to. Like the dark swoop, still, you know, still gonna eliminate that bird, right? Maybe, but it doesn't really matter if the bird's first anyway. I guess it now, might be a little bit faster. You're yeah, saying it, it might yeah. go first. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, seven, eight, six, uh, seven, seven, three. Okay, so yeah, so Henlo's, so Henlo's, Henlo's bird is faster. Um, the Biffinator. It's, it's right, the Biffinator. The Biffinator. Sorry, I got. Thank you. Thank got you. All, I got it all confuddled just then. <laughs> we all confuddled. <laughs> Can, forgive us, Biff Chain. Forgive <laughs> us. The Elijahnator, I called yeah. it. Oh, yeah, I was like, wait, but it's because I remember Elijah using that, right? So I was like, oh yeah, yeah. And CGT X need to chill. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, oh my sorry, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> too much but, hype. Too much excitement. <laughs> Rubber match, rubber team match. changes, double scarab in the house. Sphinx double... bringing that new meta. But no Lego. hills, no hills this time. So Henlo completely changed, switching it up, right? So no hills. The beast is very slow. That is a great point. It is slower yeah. than the Biffinator. Yes, yeah. I mean, this is 50 speed, so this is faster than a lot of beasts. Right? A lot of things, <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's faster 50. than like all beasts. Actually. Yeah, exactly. The thing is, is there's not there a whole lot a of damage. Mech. To... A mech could be faster. It would have to be like so. One of those. Again, if Sphinx gets the early backdoor, this game might just be over. Yeah. If agreed. Henlo can get off his bird damage into this front plant, then Henlo's in a good spot. Yeah. And what what kind of even gave Henlo a good shot last uh, game? Right, was the fact that he used the backliner bird to uh, get and got a crit with that hair. 
or that dagger or that hair dagger all right so that kind of you know kind of puts sphinx's tank on the back foot straight away right so let's see if that happens again because if not i say hendo's gonna have a really hard time getting rid of this tank as well and yeah snake double, jar. double snake jars yeah. in hand yeah in hand in hand as well look at that in the jar hand. barrage all right so skips from both guys going into round two everyone's going in hot and here we go <laughs> <laughs> there we double go. attack uh taken down yeah or double attack, minus. attack minus yeah Ooh, but not enough to kill HP. Wow. And look. so now, and now look at that. Sphinx, and he gets the critical. He gets the critical. And he's going to get the kill. Oh with, my wow. Goodness. Sphinx what a with turn. a beautiful start. What a turn. Look at that. And he gets to play. Look at that. Oh my. So he basically just does damage through the through the true damage. Yeah. Wow. That was beautiful wow. from Sphinx just then. All right, so the beast is out of here though. Oh, but oh, it but doesn't oh, matter. Oh, Hello yeah. wins. It's yeah, over. Yeah, the beast is gone. The beast is gone. All right, there we go. It took, it's only round four, but it it's took only too round long. <laughs> it took too that long. That was it. Sphinx. That was it. That's what we uh, missed on the on the uh, pre-match analysis. That beast kind of because it, uh, it well the beast did do its job actually. It, it took out the plant, but it's just that that bird was. Uh, Sphinx you know. needs triple crits. Triple yeah. crits. Yeah, this is over. One, two. And three, GG's. Henlo is going to be moving on. About what? Sphinx. It's going to be next round, though. Next, not next. Yeah, but still, yeah, Sphinx GG, yeah. put up, put up a good fight mm -hmm. and looked really solid. Yeah. Um, nice, nice switch by Henlo in the final game, yep. showing GG. that you know CTG's out here. They know what they're doing. They're paying attention, switching it up. Well done, sir. Well Jay done. Jay. Deserved. Well deserved win. <laughs> That was a fast match. Yeah, that that uh, beast was in no man's land. But I did, to be fair, the beast did do the job, right? Beast did do its job taking out that plant, but that bird, no way. Uh, keep an eye out for Itachity in your friend requests, good sir. Okay. Itachity. It, I got him. It, I got him. Axe a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Okay. Lot. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got him. Okay. Got him. Got him. All right, cool. So this is going to be our final round one match. Most of the round, the matches are reported. Um, right. And, and um, yeah, we good. We good. We good. We good. We good. I can actually tell Attachity to start as well. Yeah. Great Ready? job, everyone, to <clears throat> this week. Uh, great communication from everybody. We got a whole bunch of people from the wait list in. Uh, everyone checked in really well today. I was able to make the bracket like 18 minutes before start time. That was beautiful. Um, well done. Well done, everybody. Loving it. Absolutely loving it. People are getting better and better at this every tournament. It's fantastic. Yeah. Really appreciate that, guys, man. Really appreciate that. All right, so we are waiting for the next match to start. He is responding now, so it looks like we are good to go. Wait. <clears throat> See what he says, as long as he doesn't say, my house just burned down. Oh, are they in? <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, they're in. Wow, like they're so in. many people are all playing right. Axie right now. It's crazy. All right. They were all the way down there. Yeah. All right, ready, bro. Let's do it. Oh, three, three, two, one. Lego. Lego. Oops. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> interesting. Oh, the oh but that shrimp. That shrimp yeah, and that, that beast in yeah. the back. Oh, Rip. that shrimp and that beast in the back. Rip. Wow. I mean, this is a decent beast, though. Look at this dark swoop, sinister strike, scarab curse. And the hair dagger. We're, we're starting to see the scarabs come out now. Like it. Dude, the scarabs are all over the place. It's amazing. Liking it. But yeah, I mean, it's actually with this, with this Axie, you know. I'm gonna grab some water. I'll be right back uh, while yeah, go for waiting. It. Uh, with this Axie here, it's just going to be able to completely destroy this beast. So, damn, that sucks. 
Actually, he's got the got got another biffinator here. Hmm. And even if Mashu does use this dark swoop, it will be actually. Let's see who's faster. Oh, it's gonna. Oh, oh, actually. No, but uh, no, it's not faster than that aqua. So yeah, it's gonna go straight into the aqua. That's not really helping. Nobody. So, hmm. I'm trying to see how this match is going. This aqua can do some damage with the beast as well. But one, the one, let's just see. The one v one could potentially end up being the this midliner versus the biffinator. Still loses. Hmm. All right. Midliner versus the Biffinator sounds yeah. like a good matchup for the Biffinator. Yeah, exactly. I was just thinking about how this match could go, and obviously that backdoor just eliminates that beast. And even if the beast was to, like, you know, the Dark Soup is basically useless because it's only go it's gonna run into an Aqua. You don't wanna do that. I think best case for Mashu is <clears throat> if he drew a lot of beast cards, killed this plant quickly, mm. and was able to take out the Aqua quickly in the mid game, right? Yeah, but. Oh no, he no. backdoors into the aqua. No. Oh no, he will draw a card, but oh no. No, my I shoe. Mean, I mean, my <laughs> shoe. Who knows? Let's see. Let's see if, uh, you know, that the Gila tail is actually useless here, seeing as it's not, uh, it's not a poisoned uh, target, right? So this it's got, neural it's toxin got stats, though. Yeah, it's decent stats, stats, definitely decent stats, but does apply the attack minus to poisoned targets. So uh, I'm gonna be excited to see when people start using Gia with like um, what's it called? Tingy. Uh, Gravel uh, one. Uh, I'm mean, not uh, Gravel one. Uh, no, uh, no, no. The other reptile tail. Um, grass snake. No, the that looks like grass snake, but oh, it's iguana. purple. Oh, iguana. Iguana. Yeah, iguana. Yeah. Iguana. Exactly. Hmm. You that, know, because um, then couldn't you do the? They, you gain the, the energy if they are. If they have a buff, right? Or a minus. It's a buff, right? It is it only a positive? I think I think it, it's only I think a it positive. Might be. Yeah. I think it's only if they if they if they if oh. they have a buff, then you can oh, then so you what happens energy. is it like it counters sponge, for example. You crack the sponge and then you use it and they're like, ah, oh, yeah. Chisa. Correct, correct. Iguana's dope, yeah. Yeah. And also, you know, risky risky fish as well, right? You know, when some uh players have they use risky fish for the last round, like use it last so they have it for next round. All right, so bye bye beastie. Beast, no no chance. That was the easiest backdoor ever. Go. Gonna get some decent damage with the sandal. Not bad. But I mean, it, it actually has got energy for days right now. Okay, so the tank is out of here. 1-8-1 one, one damage with the and attack a 3v1. Yeah. A 3v1 with no energy in sight and Mashu. Mashu in much of trouble! A lot of trouble. Tachity must not be counting energy because... <laughs> 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 He's straight spamming at this point, I'm sure. <laughs> He's like, come on, no, just kill him. <laughs> just kill him, kill him. Just kill him, just kill, kill him. him. I would have saved up a bit more because that aqua, I know. like, yeah, that aqua can't really do much right now. Well, I guess he that's, just, you know. Oh, that's gonna get, hurt. Full blast. Just keep it going. Yeah, just constant pressure. Oh, there's chomps. There's chomps. It's over. There you go. We we got the double chomps with the. There you go. The cuckoo. The cuckoo. GG. Got it's him. actually taking game one. G friggin' G. GG's in the chat. If Biffinator keeps winning, we're gonna have to call it the Bossinator. Ah, 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 ah. I mean, that that beast was really, you know. Uh, well, to, to, to be honest, could have used the beast a bit better, right? Mashu, Mashu actually used the Dark Swoop, knowing there was, you know, an Aqua, you know, a pure Aqua there. Didn't really make too much sense. We shall see. All right, seems like they are getting ready to jump into the next game. Okay, great. They are in the next game. Let's do this. Three, two, one. Let's go. Lego. 
All right, All right. we will do some giveaways after this match as okay, well. Great. Wow, you're right. There's so many people playing right now. Hello. He's so far down. <laughs> I mods, let's make sure the scoreboard is uh, up to date as well, please. Uh, see you soon, Chief and Yo, uh, Sphinx, see you, see you soon, buddy. See you soon. Take care. Actually, wait, Sphinx is still in the tournament, right? Actually, no, no, no. Lost. Yeah, good, 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 good job. And yeah, see you soon, buddy. I'm sure we'll see you in the next one. Some decent plays, though. Decent plays, man. He was unlucky. Sphinx played fantastic. Yeah. Sphinx did a really, really good job. Um, I was impressed by his play. Game one, highly outmatched in that matchup and yeah, done, uh, almost well. pulled it off. Great team switch in game two. And in game three, uh, that's what happens. When you win game one, someone switches on you game two. You get to switch game three. And that's what Henlo did. He came and he did the right thing and he hard countered next. So yep. great job. Henlo won the first game close when it should have been a landslide. Yeah. If that would have gone the other way, ooh, Henlo would have been in trouble. Yeah, for sure. All right, uh, uh, the scoreboard is updated, sir. Thank you. Well done. Great job, guys. Great job. Everything is rolling. I love it. I love it. I love it. Voting is closed. Mashu Sensi actually has more votes in the Discord. Interesting. 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 I mean, Mashu needs to do work with the beast ASAP, right? Needs to get good a good draw and not use the dark soup, right? Like, don't use it. Just don't use it. It's a waste of time. Just don't right now. use it. It's yeah. a dead card. It's, it's a dead, dead card, card right in now. this matchup. Yeah. It, like Mashu needs to get as much value from this beast as possible before this before this aqua comes and you know just takes the lights out, right? Or he could try and pray that he gets um, Dark Swoop with like his three highest attacks mm. and can kill. I don't even know if that works. I don't think it would that only, would kill. It'll do, it'll do a lot of damage. If, only if the Aqua does nothing, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe. And the Dual Blade crit, maybe. <laughs> and that would be... That would, <laughs> you could just play a game where you pray that you crit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Ouch. not sure why... Okay, so unless you used the single Koi just then, don't agree with that especially when yeah, the scarab curse no is there combo, as well bonus yeah that you could be a bit maybe a bit new maybe yeah and with the scarab you would have killed and saved all that life on his tank there you go oh no see. wait he didn't have the energy he stole that he stole that he used all his energy he tried but he didn't use the scarab he used he chose to use, well they chose Correct. to use yes Correct. Uh, Koi that, yeah. instead of the Scarab, yeah. And because of the, you know, type advantage and whatnot, you want to be maximizing your cards to get in the maximum value, right? You always want to maximize efficiency. That is definitely what this game is about at, like, the basic level. Maximizing efficiency. <laughs> then oh. then uses then uses the scarab on the aqua that's like no not great but look the aqua doesn't have cards to kill yeah well that's not true we just had look just got the back door right there and the needs, energy it needed three cards mm. i don't yeah, think those yeah, two would have killed yeah probably, yeah probably yeah no yeah with the nerf as well yeah probably wouldn't have killed definitely wouldn't have and so you know, Mashu's not in a terrible spot here, even though Itachity it does have some energy. Yeah. Um, Mashu. Oh no, Itachity oh. now has the speed. So now the beast is dead. Beast is out of here. Check your ladder. Now we'll know. It would not have killed by 20. Now we know. <laughs> 100 bits. Thank you, JPLS77. Yo, appreciate what is going that. on? Appreciate the bits. I will then it just. Uh, to the stream for every excuse Sphinx has. He has an excuse? Oh, he's probably DMing with him. Oh, and those cards are gonna do no good. No good. And that's one of those times if you would have just saved that energy, right? If you would have just saved that energy. Decent damage here, but yep. four energy now from Attachity. Already got the bonuses stacking up. I. 
big shields as well. It's never gonna crack the shields. Wow. Not even gonna crack the shields. GG's for Attachity. Well done. Look at that. That's you surviving with 51 HP what, with the stun as well. And it doesn't even matter because Attachity's going first. G, freaking G! Let's go! <laughs> GG's in the chat. Let's go. Credits to you. Thank you for watch, subscribe, or I will bite your mama.